Welcome back everyone to the bonus episode. We are taking on the dojo today. As I said before, that's what exactly what we're going to be doing. I leveled up twice between the finale and this episode. Oh, you must be Mario. Welcome to my dojo. I am the master. I am the head of this dojo. <laughs> Please pardon me. My health is rather delicate. Every day we train in this dojo to improve body and mind. If you have the purpose and the desire, you may challenge us. Tell me, what business have you here today? <laughs> Try. Very well. Then Chan will fight you. Now, Chan, it is time for you to fight Mario. As you say, Master. So, I'm pretty sure the first fight's pretty basic. Mario, here comes Chan the man. I mean, they kind of intend you to pretty much just fight these over the course of the game. Obviously, I haven't been doing that, you know. Oh, how dishonorable! I haven't been doing that, obviously, so these these first couple fights should probably be pretty easy. I wouldn't be surprised if he actually fainted right here. Nope, okay, he did not. But either way, it's still an easy fight. And I really don't even know why I power jumped right there. That was kind of a waste, but oh well. Enough! The winner is Mario! Chan, you must train harder! Very well, I give you this, Mario. We got the first degree card, proof of Mario's strength won by defeating Chan at the dojo. You are welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Mario, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well, this time Lee will fight you. Now, Lee, let me see how you handle Mario. Certainly, sir. I will defeat him, Master. And notice how he's the same color. Er, whoops. I bet you've never seen a move like this before. Oh, no. Trust me, I've definitely seen that before. I was going to say, he's a different color than the ones that we faced before. He's exactly the same, pretty much. Fan smack. Eh! I wonder if he's gonna attack six times like that other one did. Oh, wait a second, I don't even need a. Well, I really don't need a block now. Alright, I'm just gonna take a hit. Wow, okay, six hits. It's just like the white ones. I thought maybe it would have been like a downgraded version. I'm actually not sure. This I'm not really sure if this guy is an upgraded version of the white ones or a downgrade or the same. I'm not really sure. Either way, fight number two is pretty straightforward too. Enough! Mario is the winner. Lee, you have much training to do. Very well, I give you this, Mario. You got a secondary card. Proof of Mario's strength won by defeating Lee at the dojo. You are welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well, it's time you fought the master. Yep. That easy. To battle! It might seem easy, but it's actually... There's a little more to this than meets the eye. You'll see soon enough. Hmm, excellent move. Yes, it was an excellent move, Master. Or, that's at least what they call you anyway. At the end of this, I will be the new Master. See, that's terrible. You can't even hit me. Close range combat. I didn't even move and you missed. Gotta check your eyesight, old man. I think you're no longer the Master, if you ask me. No, oh, I thought that was gonna make him faint. Oh, he actually does enough to bypass my defense. Alright, he means business here. Hmm, excellent move. How much is it going to take to make him faint, though? He's definitely got more health than the others so far. You have natural talent. Uh, thank you, I guess. Sure, why not? Good, good, good. Oh wow, he really does have a lot of health. 
I didn't give him enough credit. I assume he wouldn't. I assume he was only gonna be a little stronger than Lee. You have natural talent. You already said that. Lucky. That's two misses out of four attacks. That's a 50% miss rate. He's a goner. Do 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 do. Hmm. I see why you are so famous, Mario. You are truly a masterful fighter. Very well worthy adv adversary. I give you this. Proof of Mario's strength for press besting the master of the dojo. You are welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> Hold on a second, guys. I'm gonna... This, this isn't the only fight with the master. You actually fight him again, and you find out he's actually holding back. Well, to prepare for this next fight... I'm gonna just... Oops. I'm just gonna go ahead and restore my vitality. Restore my health, restore my flower points. And prepare for the worst. Did you sleep well? Yes, I did. Because the fourth fight is gonna be pretty difficult. Anyway, maybe you're wondering, how do they level up twice? Well, if you remember, I had four experience points to go after fighting Bowser. I leveled up through the castle, and then I did a second level up by fighting more Amazy Daisies. It turns out they actually do respawn, but you have to leave flower fields to refight them. <coughs> oh, Mario, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well, Mario. I will fight you again. I will not go easy on you this time, however. You must concentrate fully if you hope to compete. Oh, don't worry, Master. I will. To battle! And now he transforms. Mario, you will fall. Oh, I am ready for this. I'm taking nothing for granted here. Looks like he still has no defense. Hmm, nice maneuver. So I'm going all out myself. I'm not going to go easy on him either. I'm going to use some mega smash and some fan smash. I'm going to go completely all out in this fight. Oh, jeez. Okay, I didn't get that one. I don't think he's that tough yet, though, especially if I'm going all out. I should be able to beat him just fine. We'll see what happens, though. Oh, jeez, I actually didn't get it. I actually did not get it. That's surprising. Don't lose your concentration. I have yet to truly begin fighting back. Alright, if you say so. That was only four damage, though. Not a big deal. And I decided to use my two level ups on... Hmm, nice maneuver. I decided to use my two level ups on flower points. I had 50 HP already. It's not the max, but... But I decided to go and even my flower points up with my HP. Don't lose your concentration. I have yet to truly begin fighting back. You keep saying that, Master, but... I'm not seeing it yet. You've only done 15 damage to me. Meanwhile, I've done like... I don't know, 60? I don't even know. I probably haven't even... Ugh, excuse me. I probably haven't even done that much. Maybe I have. I don't know. Okay. The fan really is harder to get off than the regular smack. He has been defeated. Hmm. That was a solid fight. Very well. I'll give you this. Proof of Mario's strength for besting the master of the dojo. You are welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> All right, back to the inn again. Believe it or not, there is actually, if I'm not mistaken, there's another fight with him. So he actually gets even tougher. I don't know if he gains defense or not, but he, he does get tougher. And obviously to prepare for that, sleep at the inn once more. Oh, heck, I bet trying to get through all five fights... I think it's five fights. Trying to get through all five fights in one go without sleeping it in, that's rough now. Alright, we're gonna save up. Well, we already did save up. I'm saying that in the past now. Anyway, back to the dojo. Time for the ultimate showdown versus the master. I don't know if he's gonna have any defense or not. Maybe he will. I might have to switch out a bow. <laughs> 
Ah, Mario, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well. I will fight you once more. This time I will hold nothing back at all. Do you believe you're ready? Yes, I do. To battle! Now he's got an aura around. Ah, behold my fury, Mario! He's pretty much just gone Super Saiyan at this point. Alright. Any defense? Please, no defense. Okay, he has defense. Hmm, you have great hidden strength for one clothed like a plumber. Like a plumber? I am a plumber. Alright, time to switch out. What? Yeah, let's go with Watt, since he can penetrate defense. Okay, that was almost not fair, but we blocked one of the attacks anyway. <laughs> Jeez, I was not even ready for that. Hmm, can I paralyze him? I'm gonna try. Oh, great, 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 I can't really. I can't really, nope, nope, wasted to some flower points. Ah, <laughs> Mario, survive this if you can! Oh, yeah, oh! Holy cow, three attacks! Man, he really isn't holding back here. I have to go all out in this fight. Man, oh my gosh. Alright, Watt, do it. Alright, okay, uh, Mario, survive this if you can! Oh, he doesn't even, he just stops attacking after that miss. Okay, that's awesome. We just, that's like freaking dodging a bullet right there. Hmm, you have great hidden strength for one clothed like a plumber. I already know that, because you've said that before. Hey, ah, Mario, survive this if you can! Alright, he's gonna attack again? Yeah! Super! That was not bad at all. Let's go ahead and use a smooch. Get our health back. And that way we can also start the recharge process, too. In case we need it. I don't know if he's tough. I don't know, he might be tougher than Bowser. And Bowser wasn't exactly an easy fight to get out of out of with no item usage at all, but. I don't know, who knows? Now it is time I stop being so merciful. Oh what? That's that's just it? He just Okay, I was expecting him like attack four times right there, but he didn't do it. Pleasantly surprised, not gonna lie. Hmm, you have great hidden strengths with one clothed like a plumber. I don't know why he keeps saying that. He, he keeps saying it, but yet I keep reading it for some reason. That is... Okay, yes, it's stop time being merciful. Mario, survive this if you can. Ah! Come on. Nope, okay, that was bad timing. We can do this. He's probably almost dead. Now, who has the most health in the game, him or Bowser? I think I actually read that Bowser has 99 health. Oh, what's this? Oh, Lucky! I think Bowser has 99 health, but I think it's the max? I'm not really sure how much he has, though. He might have 99, too. You have great hidden strength. Yes, I know. And Watt also has great hidden strength. It's called electricity. You can power a city. Oh, too early. Too early. Oh well. Smooch. Oh my, this is. Wait, what is that in the background? Oh wow. Okay, I'm just now noticing that. <laughs> that's been there the whole time, apparently. I thought that was like a glitch at first, but I guess that's just been hanging around the edges the whole time. Yes, yeah, stop being merciful, I get it. Ugh, ugh. Man, blocking both of those is still just five damage. It's pretty pretty tough. Alright, good, good. Oh, oh, we beat him. Sweet. No surprisingly nothing to it, really. Hmm. <laughs> Noble Mario. You have best me, the master, the strongest of fighters. Since you have beaten me at my full strength, I give you this with respect. 
You got a diploma. Proof of Mario's strength. Now, Mario is the strongest. Alright, that's it. That's it, I guess. Well, for the sake of curiosity, this is what I'm going to do. Yes, I am going to go back to the end one more time, just because, you know, I don't know, why not? I'd, I'd feel better at full health and full flower coins, but... Uh, to be honest, it's probably not super necessary. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to go back to the desert, talk to that one toad, who was asking me about a degree card, see what happens when he realizes I have a really good... a really good card, a diploma nonetheless. And then, I'm going to see after that... What's this? All or nothing at the action command work... Wow. Wow, no kidding. Anyway. Actually, that might be pretty useful now that I think about that, but... Oh, well. So, we're going to be back to the desert. We're going to talk to that toad. Who wanted to know about it. And then, after that, we're going to go to the... What's it called? Shiver City, I think. And talk to that penguin who was curious about my degree card also. And then, well, that'll be it, I guess. I mean, I can't really think of anything else I'd want to get done in this episode. I really only just wanted to get the dojo done. Oh, yeah, and by the way, the red palm tree. Let's see if anything happens. No? Well, we already... Oh, wait, okay, now he says it. Excuse me, can I talk to you for a sec? What exactly are you doing walking around that tree? You're making me dizzy. He wasn't even looking at me. What? You're joking! You believe some crazy dream? Well, okay, I guess. I mean, I got a message in a dream a long time ago, but it didn't mean anything. It said there's a house with a whirling roof in a large town near a castle. If you spin jump three times inside the house, something good should happen to you. <laughs> a house with a whirling roof, as if that existed. Ha! <laughs> I don't take dreams seriously. And apparently he's never been to Toad Town. Okay, so which one taught... Well, son of a gun. Go Wiz! It's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo. Want to try the quiz? Sure. Then let's go to the question. Filler content, hooray. Question. Which of Mario's battle commands is on the far left? Strategies. I'd be ashamed if I didn't know that. Correct! Congratulations! Here's your star piece. You've correctly answered five questions so far. Good luck next time. Well, well, so long, farewell, till we meet again. I actually ended up answering, like, coming back to Toad Town from Bowser's Castle, I actually ended up answering another question. I did not get that on, on, the, on the recording, so sorry about that, guys. Say, is that a diploma? Whoa, whoa, you defeated the master. That's unbelievable, Mario. Great, seriously great. I mean, really great. Well, that was... that was unproductive. Very well. Let us return to the... Uh, they. Let us return to the... Icelands. Let us return to THE Icelands. Shiver City. We're gonna talk to that penguin. Because... You know what? Penguins are great. Penguins are awesome. Can you believe it? Of course. Oh, you know, I should have... No, never mind. That's, that'd be stupid. There's no real point. I'm pretty sure I read that, that Rip Cheeto the donut guy. I'm pretty sure he just gives you random items. It doesn't really... Or I guess it's not random items, but it's like predetermined random items. So I think if I read correctly, the second item he gives you after the star piece is actually going to be a life shroom, so it's not a bad deal. It's, ab it's above market value, but still not a bad deal. But event like one of the random items he gives you is like a dry shroom, so he does rip you off occasionally. Hey, you have a diploma? Wow, I mean, wow! You beat the master! How'd you manage that? You're the strongest guy ever! You know, you beat the master, too, so... <laughs> I don't know. I mean, he, he he didn't beat his full form, but he did beat the master. Because he had a third-degree card. Which you only get by beating the master one time. Oh, well. So this is how we're going to end this. 
because I don't really know what else to do in terms of optional content. I'm going to pay a visit to Taste Tea for no good reason at all. And we're just going to try some random ingredient combinations just for the heck of it. We're going to try an Ultra Shroom with some jam and jelly. Then I shall cook with Ultra Shroom and jam and jelly. I'll whip something special up just for you, honey. It'll be fabulous. Just a moment. We'll see about that. Here you are. This recipe's not too bad. Here, please. Oh, oh, wow. No kidding. A dessert made by Tasty restores 50 HP and 50 flower points. Come back anytime, hon. I look forward to it. That's actually kind of cool. Alright, what else? I don't suppose we can make a life shroom. Alright, how about this? Shooting stars. And... A repel gel. Invisible shooting stars. Sounds like a plan. I don't know how exactly you can cook with that, but you know... Apparently it's accepted for whatever reason. Oh, I'm so sorry. This recipe didn't work out. Oh well, here please. You got the mistake. Turning shooting stars into... What looks like a rotten apple to me. Wait a second. Oh, good lord. Would you like to, me to use another ingredient? Or, wait, no, no, I don't want you to use another ingredient. What's the matter? Make with one. And then I shall cook with mistake. What happens if you cook with a mistake? Sha la 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 la. Oh, I'm so sorry. This recipe is still a mistake. <laughs> Okay, makes a lot of sense. Alright, what do we got? We got a ton of jam and jelly, I see, so... Alright, this is what... Oh. Oh, wait a second, no. Oh, wait, yes, I can do that. I can't actually do this. I thought for a second I couldn't. I'll cook with two mushrooms. Ultra Shroom and Life Shroom. Cha la 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 la. Here you are. This recipe's not too bad. Shroom steak. Oh, that's actually not too bad. 30 HP and 10 flower points. I mean, of course, it's worse than the Ultra Shroom, but still. It ended up not being too bad. Alright, jam and jelly. And a life shroom. Let's see what that makes anything. -la 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 -la. Here you are. This recipe's not too bad. Here, please. Jelly Super. Oh, you can actually do that. A dessert made by Tasty. 10 and 50. So I'm guessing with a regular mushroom, that would be 5 and 50? That seems kind of silly, but oh well. Alright, what do we got next here? We got... <laughs> oh, this should work out very well. Let's do a jam and jelly with another jam and jelly. Oh, Well, that's lame. How about jam and jelly on a shroom steak? Yeah, 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 yeah. This, this should be great. -la 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 -la. We're gonna turn this into a mistake. Oh, I'm so sorry. This recipe didn't work out. Yay, a mistake. Alright, what now? We got... Alright, jam and jelly. And a mistake. And we're just trying out all sorts of combinations here. -la 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 -la. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not surprised, really. Okay, how about a mistake? Oh, wait, I just realized something. You can't do that. This is the same ingredient. Okay, yeah, fine. What's the matter? Alright, I'm gonna stop. And for the final one, Jelly Ultra and Jelly Super. This should be interesting. I'm gonna just take a wild guess and say it's gonna be a mistake, but... You never know. Oh, I'm so sorry. This recipe didn't turn out so well. Alright. 
Now we got, yeah. Yeah, the mistake trifecta. Way to go, Tasty. You're the worst cook ever. You've made three mistakes. Three strikes, you're out. Game over. Nope. Alright, last course of action here. We're gonna go somewhere that we have not gone to in this playthrough, except for the very beginning of the game. We're going back to Mario and Luigi's house. You know what's dumb? Luigi lives here, yet the house says Mario. Why doesn't it say Mario and Luigi? I think Mario's an egomaniac. He doesn't like Luigi. Alright, here's the board. Coins earns 1,788. Badges collected 56 out of 80. Star pieces collected 37 out of 160. That just goes to show how many badges and star pieces there are. Tasty's recipes, 7 out of 50. Chuck Quizmo's quizzes, 5 out of 5. Uh, don't worry, there's more than 5, I can tell you that. Number of battles, 373. Doesn't seem like that many, does it? Your first strikes, 210. Enemy first strikes, 39. Total power bounces, 14. That's pretty much it with that. There's some mailbox right here, where everyone starts sending you mail. I don't even know who this guy is, honestly. That's the that's the uh, co-host of Chuck Quizmo. Even the Cooper Bros send you some hate mail for some reason. Cooper Troopas saying thanks for the fuzzy problem, blah blah blah. Mustafa telling you about the ruins because stuff happened. Colorado telling you about the desert. Goombario asking about Goombario, the laziest Goomba I've ever seen. Tasty talking about the cookbook that we gave her. And a recipe for an egg fire flower combination. Colorado once again, this time talking about the volcanic island Mount Lava Lava. Yoshi kids, blah blah blah. Rof talking about a sale, and you can't believe what he's gonna say here. He's gonna say, I'll be waiting for you with all my stocks 0% off. I've actually read these ahead of time, that's kind of why I'm skipping over them. I don't really want to read them again, sorry. Dear Mario, how are you holding up? And then the flowers pretty much just talk to you. Actually, no, it's not the flowers, it's actually the tree that writes to you. That's kind of the weird thing. And then down here, you got Luigi's Diary. If you keep up to date with this, he pretty much just talks about everything that Mario is doing. He's like, he's jealous that he's not in the adventure, but he's like, oh well. And I think during a certain chapter, if you actually come down here, I think you actually end up finding Luigi down there himself while he's messing with his diary. He's going to be like, oh, hey, what are you doing, Mario? Or something like that. I don't even know what he does. Well, anyway, guys, that's the end of the bonus episode. I don't really have anything else I can think of I'd want to show. So, I guess that's it. Let's just go see what... Oh, no, no, wait a second. That's not it. There's actually one more thing. I want to, like, go to the cafe randomly just because... I didn't really give that its fair share of viewing time, really. I just kind of, like, ran in there, ran out once I saw the the bartender. I'm just like, okay, I'm out of here. See ya. But no, I didn't even actually give that a fair fair look. So I'm going to I'm gonna redeem that real quick, and I'm going to go take a look at that. And then that'll be that. Hello, Chet Rippo. Alright, alright, come on. Let's move, people, move. All right, here we go. Oh, that's this guy. All right. I may not be one of those mystical stars, but I know people's wishes, all right? Seems like every customer I have been bends to my ear a while. I've been hearing people's wishes ever since I first opened this place up. Welcome to Club 64. You believe this? That whale's been really good for the biz. All these people come for the whale and stay for the food. This joint's been jumping. I'm Simon. I'm rhyming to folks who know it. I'm the master poet. Poor pop diva cannot sing, but my lyrics are just the thing. If my lyrics really rock, our pop diva will be cured of shock. 
I'm tragically struck, though, because my last line's a no-show. Later, Plumminator. Okay. Mm, hi! I'm Chantillary! I'm known around here as the Pop Diva of Go Town. Oh, I used to be able to sing any song perfectly, each note a masterpiece. Those times are behind me now, perhaps forever. The sight of Peach's castle flying high in the sky was such a shock I haven't been able to sing since then. And now, now I am a pop diva who cannot sing. Cruel irony, isn't it? Well, I don't know if there's something to this place that I'm missing. But, that's pretty much it, I guess. I don't know. So, yeah, I guess that's it, guys. That is Paper Mario. I hope you guys enjoyed Paper Mario. The next video you will see will be the winner of the poll. Right now, at this moment of the video being made, Majora's Mask is winning. Final Fantasy VII's trailing and as the closest competitor, and the other three are kind of a little far behind, but you know, always time to make up some ground. Uh, yep. Well, anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed Paper Mario. Bye bye. I love the Shell 7 seeds, very different.